not in here. Yes. So you know this inside out. Yes. Okay. So. Can you tell me? Okay, I have two questions. Yeah, because Amy has a lot of wonderful ideas, and it is really very hard. Yeah. That's good. Okay. Is there anything there? So, um, first question, have you thought of um, the, the orchestration for different instruments? Uh, no. Not really. Okay, yeah. I think um, we can probably think of orchestration in, in some way. Or the organ. Definitely towards the end. That's the organ sound when you have the octave. So think of the, the, the sound uh, of the organ there instead of just uh, 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 let, me see. let the sound emerge from the keys instead of uh, working down. It's just some, some idea. Yeah, it's when you think of organ, because I thought it really uh, resonates. Yeah. Um, that's the first question. Second question, it's chromatic, right? Because we, we, we know the title. Can you tell me? The subject for the first two measures, do you know what the key is? Can you play? What is the key? Uh, <laughs> We're not quite sure, right? Yeah. And then can you play the next two measures? Does that change the character of the theme for you? Because I think it's really searching. And also, how many measures is this subject? Eight? Yes. Yeah. Actually, I would say seven. The, then the dun 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 is like a bridge connection, right? Yeah. So it's an odd number, and then you don't know the key until actually the last three. Because you start from that gives us some uh, clue, because that F not definitely yeah. um, hit that, because we, from the second, uh, the, the third, the third measure. We hear it has the F sharp. The F sharp doesn't belong to D minor. Right. So can you have all this into your uh, subject? I mean the, the character of the subject of the theme. Yeah. Uh, to me this is really a, a like a searching a, a journey of searching instead of just so so assured. Yeah. And then when you get to the cadence, then you need to do that. Yeah. So I want to hear um, where you are in terms of the, uh, the tonal structure. Yeah. I think he did very well on the subject or non-subject. And then even uh, he did very well on the structure of the subject. Yeah. And you know, uh, when we were wandering around in the development, uh, uh, just on all different things, he did really well. But I think in the subject itself, we can do something even more. Yeah. Can we try from the beginning? So then, to me, this to me, it's kind of suspension. You raise the question. Yeah, because it starts with the chromatic system right away. I'm telling you, 
I have a question for you. You don't have to answer to me. So I ask one more time. This time, does it stand? And I don't go all the way. I don't go all the way, right? So the second time, I actually. And I give you some clue what's in my mind. Yeah, can you tell me this? So I think um, it, it just within the, uh, the subject itself, actually, that's very rich. It has a lot of different things going on. Yeah. Can we try one more time? And then, then it becomes ba ba bum ba ba bum. Yeah, you did that very well. I, I like the way you do that. OK, now, we try. to hear that. And then I have a question. When you the second time when he comes in, he already did some lyrics. Because he does that's the first time uh, the Dr. Rotom was introduced. So make sure you have the Dr. Rotom uh, idea. Because I think it, it was somewhere in between Hitler and uh, Dr. Rotom. And then I think there is uh, 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 purpose that he used the doctor level because there is some sharpness of resonance energy there. Yeah. From bum 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 ba ba ba. And then this one actually I hear the Yeah you land on this one. I don't think this is the uh, you know that that important yet because you want to go like you want to, you want to go there. You know that's the, the highest point of this. Now can we try from here? Yes. All right. I think now you calculate uh, the, the um, 
the journey really well. Yeah. yeah. How, how much do you want to go the first too far? How much do you want to go the second too far? That's good. But then now, I think it's a little bit too much calculation. I don't have that one phrase. Yeah. No. Can you don't, uh, can you, can you uh, have a longer phrase in mind without losing the, the calculated dynamics? Okay, now please one more time. Harder. <laughs> yeah, but you are doing great. Can we try from here one more time? Then 
then, then there is no room for, for further on. Yeah, so in this way, so uh, uh, in, in, the, in case, in this case, too. And you have three times go down and then a bridge. So actually, Bach is very, very logical. He's making all this, you know, very mystical. Yeah. So can I can, can you really see how he he was a um mis, mis, uh, math math mathematician something yeah right right right, right, right. yes. Yeah, so he was so good in uh, in doing all this. So we need to do it um, accordingly too. Can we try from here?
Yes, it's a G minor of very uh, as some would expect it. Uh, Not really, right? Yes. So then we have been like um, in the wilderness, you know, with all those things. So can you make the G minor some kind of special character among them? Yeah. Can we get into it um, somewhere there? When you get to here, that definitely because that's a cadence. I think that's that's thicker. But then when you do the da da dum da dum da dum da dum da dum, I think this are only the counter subject. We don't have any subject going on because the subject is a bomb, 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 right? But then the da da dum da dum da dum da dum da dum. So I would actually just to uh, do me a favor. You do the cadence there and then drop up a little bit and then go on. Can we try that? Yeah, can we try? So like this in this case, so we were in
So then we hear it from. So he's definitely using all different ways of uh, uh, the subject. Can we talk about it?
injuries, and before then you can still play. That's that's great. Yes. So um, I hope when I, one day I can hear you play the whole thing. Yes, that's good. Okay. Can you tell me what's a challenge for you? Uh, biggest challenge. agree with that, yes. <laughs> and then um, should be actually um, a lot of repeats. <laughs> yeah, that to me is always troublesome. Yeah, it's just, it's, um, you know, sometimes I feel he was mumbling <laughs> and he's talking to himself. But then actually that's, that's, that's probably him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. So he has this kind of inner stuff. Yeah, right. So then I think was, um, a lot of repeats, it seems we need to have a lot of different colors. Yes. And I definitely see that um, you know we do a lot of dynamics. But I think we can do more like that. Okay. Okay, that's good. So can we try from the uh, very beginning? Yes. Um, you know, um, I want to see the difference between piano and piano string. So what I would do is actually do the F sharp softer instead of hitting the key too loud. I like the way you do the F sharp, but then that's the beginning of the crescendo. How about the the, the G? That should be piano. But then I don't hear that you actually went down to where you start the Mm -hmm. And then you need to calculate how much you want to go the crescendo because the da 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 afterwards is a forte. So if you do the crescendo too much, then we wouldn't have the concept afterwards. All right, can we try that? So I think that C is a little bit too much. And then how about uh, uh, the, the slur on top? Because he has the as a slur. If you do the C like an accent, then I don't feel that's the phrase. Yeah. So I wouldn't go. Oh, oh like if you want to sing that, how would you sing? Would you, would you sing? Probably not, right? So we go. Their dating was just don't go anywhere. Just okay, both of them are uh, pianists. They were just sitting in the hall and then playing Schumann all the time. <laughs> yeah, that's then that they understand the love language there. Yeah, so um, um, you know, Schumann just uh, writes a lot of um, uh, vocal lines. Yes, so uh, and then he writes a lot of songs, right? Yes, so then uh, imagine if. Um, you were to sing this, how would you break? How would you shake? Yeah. So we come and did much better the second time. Stronger. 
So can we have that? So I, I think he actually um, written down a lot of details there. If we look carefully, then, then we can make different uh, meanings out of all this. And then this, this side, you get to do a little bit more. Yeah. And one thing that uh, I want you to be very cautious is that when you do, um, uh, right before the forte, because we have a lot of da-da, da-da, forte. Um, a lot of times, actually, uh, it's a demando. So don't do a crescendo towards there. Yeah, like this. So, so that's something you, you want to be very careful. Can we try it from here? Um, 
and I don't feel the opposite of this, of the other. Yeah. So, so imagine the, the, the top, the da di da, yeah, continue. Uh -huh. Can we try?
um, the, the solitude there. Yeah, otherwise we, we, we really lose it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can we And then the second time, because you see this uh, staccato there, I think the second time you can probably uh, emphasize a little bit of this.
That's great. That's great. I think that's the idea for this piece. And then you can do this, the same kind of, this could, could be a um, comment on the thinking. Uh, I know it's the metaphoric, but then you don't start with the turn, uh, start the turn with it. Not da 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 da
Yeah. How long have you been working on this? I've been working on this just for like, for like, I think from the beginning when I was learning probably almost a year. Almost a year. Yeah. It's like a bad one too. And uh, sorry, it's not really good because I just, I just reviewed it this morning. <laughs> I wish I could do that for you this morning and then I can play like that. That's great. That's so great. From the stage. Oh, yeah. It's just, I think yeah, uh, if you know this piece really well, and then I know those mistakes that, that when you have more time, um, you definitely have to uh, take that back. I'll just have um, some general comments for you. I think it was a little bit too much public in terms of. Uh, You know, because I think um, I almost can put down a majority there. <laughs> yeah, but then um, I think some of the ace notes can move a little bit. Yes, yeah. Because, um, so so tell me a little bit about this piece that I want to know about. Right so this only is about a girl in the ocean, which is in the ocean. So then, firstly, you have water, yeah? Because water kind of calculates it. <laughs> Is that way? No. So, so you are dealing with water. Secondly, you are dealing with a girl and falling in love, right? Yes. So when you, um, okay, if I say, I love you, <laughs> no, you don't, you don't do that way, right? Yes. So a lot of human voices, you don't really sound Da, da, da. I know the writing is just extremely hard. <laughs> so then you have probably ninety nine percent of your attention on the technique. Yeah, but then I think it's about the pace. I think a lot of uh, effort has flowed that I need to feel. That's that that's I, I think that's a, 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 um, what I can I think you can you can um, do it right now. Yeah. 
have afterwards either. So this is just rising, rising, rising. There, yes. So can you um, you know, find the, the important notes there? And then, um, the, 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 yes, uh, I think this oh, one, yeah. right? Yes, yeah. And then you have da, 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 T. That's the first time you officially have the pressure in the picture. So can I feel how you, 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 you kind of um, you introduce this, this early, yeah, instead of all in the same, at the same place, yeah, just feel the, the, the water and then, uh, you know, this to walk in somewhere. Yeah. Can we try it from the beginning? Uh, from, from the left hand. From the left hand. I think it's a little bit too forceful to me at the beginning.
into this. Yeah, I think this can fit into this. Can we try? Oh, okay. much better. Now, this is the part you have to, so you really have to reach that. So then I think that piano is important. So then you can really do, and then use this with the, uh, with the notebook, right? just, just draw them up. And then that can reach to this one. And then make sure this, you put the pedal down there. Every time you have the eighth notes, not really holding back. 
and then watch out for um, how you know, uh, if you can uh, if there are several channels if you can back up a little bit that you make the uh, you know now I feel that you you reach the climax. I think your your idea is probably your mom. Oh, that's great. That's great. But then you you are beautifully taught, and then you you are a very beautiful piece. Thank you so very thank much. Thank you so much. Thank you.